2021 Cadillac Escalade Review. Bigger, bolder, better than ever. But before we start, please support us by pressing the like and subscribe buttons, so that we can continue to provide information about car and motorcycle news. Also turn on the bell button to get the latest updates. Your support means a lot to us. Thank you. What's the best vehicle for a long road trip? Some would probably say a minivan, while others might suggest a unibody crossover, but after driving 250 miles from Atlanta to the Smoky Mountain National Park in Tennessee, the 2021 Cadillac Escalade should probably be on that list too. We hesitantly booked the luxurious SUV for the long drive, unsure if the 5,800-pound vehicle would be able to tackle the steep inclines and twisty mountain roads required of it. But it was obvious after a short while on the road that the Escalade was more than up for the journey. The V8 offered plenty of grunt for uphill climbs. The optional magnetic ride control system delivered extreme comfort and exceptional competence in the curves. Plus there was plenty of tech to keep front and passengers entertained. So if you can swing the $107,915 as tested price, the 2021 Cadillac Escalade is an awesome vehicle over long distances. The Cadillac Escalade stands at 76.7 inches, 6.4 feet, tall from tire to roof. It's one of the largest SUVs on sale today and absolutely looks it, hulking over every other vehicle in the car park. Slim LED headlights attempt to modernize the otherwise garish, oversized look, and they sort of help, but the too big grille with horizontal chrome inserts takes up most of the face. And waterfall-like LED accents adorn each side of the bumper surrounded by chrome trim. That chrome extends to the side profile too, separating the second and third row windows with a single piece of shiny metallic. The wheels pictured here are the most basic on offer for this trim 22 inches with 14 spokes and finished in bright silver. There are three better wheel options if you're willing to spend $1,995. The backside of the Escalade isn't any less gaudy, with its overuse of chrome trim and badging, but the vertical taillights are a nice touch that help offset those shiny exterior pieces. And you can get this car in any standard color you want, as long as it's black, every other color is a $625 option or $1,125 for crystal white metallic. Inside is where the Escalade comes into its own. Handsome Whisper beige leather coats the seats, Jet black leather accents cover the dash, and a dark lacquered wood grain lies between. Typically we're down on lacquered wood, but somehow Cadillac pulls it off here, it doesn't feel out of place for a cabin that looks extremely modern otherwise. The piece de resistance is the massive array of screens atop the dash. A 16.9-inch OLED display occupies the upper portion of the dash, largest in the class, joined by a 14.2-inch digital instrument cluster and a third 7.2-inch screen just to the left of the steering wheel, all arranged in a swooping semicircular design. Although the Escalade's exterior is still very old school, the cabin feels like a futuristic cockpit. In the 245-plus mile trek between Atlanta, Georgia, and Pigeon Forge, Tennessee, the Cadillac Escalade proved to be the perfect highway companion in more ways than one. With the optional Magneride suspension equipped, the ride quality was sublime. The Escalade absorbed every imperfection in the road, even handling dirt pull-offs with poise. Not even the 22-inch wheels hampered the experience, never once did the Escalade feel too harsh.
Thanks for watching. Drop a like, leave a comment, and don't forget to subscribe to watch more videos like this.